Hey Busy Bees! Today I'm going to show you some fun summer hairstyles. My sister is amazing at doing hair and I thought it would be fun to collaborate with her to show you some amazing and easy hairstyles that you can actually do yourself for weddings, uh, the beach, or just everyday looks. I have really thick hair due to the pregnancy so this bumble and bumble kit has been so good. And this is a thick hair styler. It just makes it a little bit more gritty and manageable. It'll make it look kind of wavy and just gives it a little bit of style. Now I'm starting off with hair that I've already dried and curled. These hairstyles work best with day old hair. So first one we're going to do is this boho twisted crown braid. Alright, my sister's going in with the Surf Infusion Spray to give it a little bit of texture. And this will just help the hairstyles hold better. Ah, beachy waves. For the bohemian crown, we're going to start with a small section of hair on the top right. We're going to split it in two, twist the right side up, and grabbing a small section of hair towards the bottom, combine it and twist it again. We'll continue that pattern, bottom piece, combine it to the bottom twist, and twist it up. We'll keep braiding like that until we meet the middle back of the head. Then we'll keep twisting it and tie it off at the end. Great! We'll repeat the same pattern on the left side. Remember always to twist up, grab the bottom, pull under and twist up. Pull under and twist up. It's best if you work your way a little bit at a time. Now to twist it together, on the left side where we have a twist, go ahead and put your fingers through one of the twists and grabbing the right hair strand, loop it through. Pull it tight and give it a good twist to secure it and then with the bobby pin just go in at the bottom. You'll probably need about four bobby pins to keep it secure. Finally take out the rubber bands and fluff it up. Gorgeous! If you feel any loose hair on the side just tuck it in with the bobby pin. This hair is not going anywhere. It looks like you spent so much time on it but it's so easy right? Quick check in the mirror, front looks good, back looks great. This look is perfect for those days where you just need a little bit of flair. My favorite part is that loose knot twist in the back, it just looks so unique and the rest of the hair from the back just cascades down from it. Highlighted hair would really accent this look, especially in the summer. Oh, what's going on here? I am about to get my arms cut off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for the second look, we're going to go back in with some spray. Starting with the center back of the head, we're going to take a section of hair and split it into two. We're going to cross the left side over the right, and then taking another small section on the right side, we're going to pull it over and cross it to join the left hair section. We're going to weave the left section of hair over to join the right. Make sure to pull tightly after each section. Again, we're going to take the left, loop it over to join the right, so you always have two really thick strands of hair. And then you just braid it all the way down. This, in essence, is a lot easier to do than a regular French braid because you only have two really thick strands. Once you get to the nape of the neck where you don't have to pull any more from the head, you're going to divide it into four strands. Basically, you're taking the outside of each of the thick strand, dividing it into two, crossing it over, and combining. Keep doing that until you reach the end and then tie it up with a hairband. This look is great for those days when you have a bad hair day. I do this all the time. Also, if you have really long hair, this will look so beautiful with the fishtail just going down. I don't have really long hair right now, but you get the idea. And the last one is an easy chignon that would look amazing for a summer wedding. 
To prep our hair for the last look, we're just going to spray it again. With your hair down, start on the left side and grab a small section on the left. Take two strands and twist them, bottom coming over the top. This is very similar to our first look except we're doing it lower. Continue twisting bottom up until you reach the nape of the neck. Tie it off and then we're going to do the right side. With a small section of hair, split it in two and twist the bottom up. Grab the bottom section and combine it. Twist it up. Bottom, combine, twist up. Bottom, combine, twist up. This creates a really nice and elegant braid. When we get down to the nape, we're going to combine the two braids into a ponytail. Now taking the middle part of the hair, we're going to make sure we have enough space, loosen it up. Taking the ponytail, just twist it up and loop it through. Now to create our bun, we're going to take the remaining hair of the ponytail. We're going to roll it up around our fingers, twist it over, and tuck it in. And then we're just going to secure it with a few bobby pins. If there's any loose hair sticking out, just hairspray it down or tuck it in with some bobby pins. This romantic look would be so appropriate for a wedding or just a beautiful evening soiree. What do you think, guys? I would love to wear this look with the flowy dress. Ah, oh, so beautiful. Thank you so much, Tram, for all your help. You are amazing at this. So these are really easy hairstyles I think would work for concert, festivals, um, I don't know, I'm lucky enough that anytime I need my hair done I would ask my sister to do it and she used to braid my hair all the time growing up. Let me know what you think of these hairstyle videos and if you guys want to see more of them I would love to do them once a month um, and I think it would be fun. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment below and let me know which hairstyle you would try. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye!